Well, hi, you two. You know, behind me are some of the scooters now available in Culver City, and the city hopes it will make a big difference in helping people get around, but you've got to be safe. I'm glad that I practice on my kids' scooters sometimes at home. Eric Hatfield has been waiting for electric scooters to come to Culver City. His kids live here, and he's excited for a new way to move around when he visits. I think it's an alternative way to get around town, and it seems like it's super easy to use. I see people using them all the time. Elka Balwig is also excited and happy they're here. She says she knows exactly where she'll ride them to. Around the neighborhood to the Culver City Senior Center. Today was the launch of Bird Electric Scooters around this community. The idea, an easy way to get to and from destinations. The mayor says they're starting with about 100 scooters at 50 locations across Culver City. Bus stops at the train stations near the restaurants downtown, workplaces, and in the residential neighborhoods. But along with the launch came a safety lesson. Helmets, how to properly ride the scooters, and the rules. You need to be over 18. You need to have a valid California driver's license and you need to have a helmet. This lesson comes at a time when electric scooters are under fire, banned in some cities, emergency rooms seeing more accident victims, residents saying their walkways and pathways are dangerous. With safety a priority, the mayor promises if things get out of control, the city will handle it. We can pull back or push forward, you know, almost on a daily basis. So we have the ability to speed it up, slow it down and stop it all together uh, as per our agreement. I just figured it out. Eric Hatfield believes these scooters are a good thing and will make a difference. He just hopes people will do exactly what he's doing, taking the time to learn to use them in the right way. I'm just hoping that everybody learns how to use them responsibly. Now the mayor says if you do not abide by the rules or wear a helmet, you will get a ticket. In Culver City, I'm Lisa Siegel, KCAL 9 News. Back to you guys. All right, Lisa.